In this video, I'm going to show you how to get a 5 icon dock on your 1.1.4 iPhone or iPod Touch. Um, if you don't know what a 5 icon dock means, um, the dock is the 4 icons that are, that are at the bottom of your screen. And you can they stay there even though you're even though you scroll through icon through your icon pages, so you can always have them wherever you are. So I'm going to show you how to do that now. First, you're going to have to open up Installer. Mine's a little bit slow, so just wait. Okay, now you're going to go to the Sources page, and you're going to have to add a source. I will display that on the screen now, and it will be to the right of the video in the video description. It's uh, called, it should be called Hebrew Packs and More. And that is a really good source actually. It doesn't really have anything to do with Hebrew. It has one little folder about Hebrew stuff. That's a really good source because they got a lot of cracked apps and stuff on it. Okay, the first thing you're going to do is go to All Packages, which you've added the source, and search C A T E R. You should just search Catter and it should bring up Caterpillar. And then Caterpillar, just click search. Click Caterpillar 1.1.1. Make sure you do not click Caterpillar. Click 1.1.1. Okay, and you're going to install that. It's 2.2 megabytes, depending on your connection. It may take longer for you. Okay, it's done. It's installing. And it says don't forget to run Caterpillar after you, you just ignore that right now. Okay, now it's done. Now what you're going to do is have you have to go to the home screen. And it will refresh. It's a weird way to install this, but this is how you have to do it. Okay, now you should have the Kate or Caterpillar app. It has a little uh, like Caterpillar Caterpillar face. Now open it up, and it should you should see like this. Okay, the next time you open it up, you're not going to see that. If you do, then you didn't do it right. Okay, now open back up, open installer back up, and now go to install all packages. And then search again, search for Catter again, just like you did before. And then you will see Caterpillar 1.1.1 patch. Install that. Install. Just it should download really quick. And then it just gives you a notice. You can read that. And then hit OK. Okay, now that's done, hit the home button, go home. Okay, now what you're going to have to do is open up Caterpillar. And now when you open it up, it shouldn't ask you to enter the uh, code, activation code, because you've cracked the app now. Okay, now you're going to hit to the for the five icon dock you're going to use Facebook and only Facebook the other ones you can use, you can look at them if you want to they're I, ha I don't really use none of them at all the system fonts pretty cool you can change all your fonts on your apps and all that and stuff but um you can check that out later but for right now download this just select facelift that's the only one you're going to select and then hit apply and then it will apply everything and then you can go home once it's done refreshing and everything go to settings then scroll down and you will see a rip dev category now go to the rip dev category go to caterpillar and it should say never unlimited use if it doesn't say that if it says expired or anything like that then you do you did something wrong just try to repeat the process okay now select turn on the five icon dock and if you want the reflective dock you can turn that on also then go back and then go back into caterpillar and then hit restart springboard you must do it in this order select five icon dock 
and then if you want the other one, the reflective dock, select that, and then go back, and then go to Caterpillar, and then select Restart Springboard, and then hit OK. You must do it this way, or it will not work. Okay, and then I've just got to enter a password. Okay, and now you should have the five icon dot go down and drag it in there. And there you go. Five icon dock on 1.4 iPhone or iPod Touch. Okay, thanks for watching. Please subscribe, comment, rate, favorite, and if you have any problems, uh, leave me a comment or message me. And please donate at TizeHoffManHelp.com for all of my hard work.